good enough to lead at this point of the free skate. Another skater from Japan taking the ice now, 16-year-old Satoko Miyahara. The four continent silver medalist from 2014. Quite an accomplishment at the end of the season for the skater who won the bronze medal in 2013 at the Japanese National Championships. And you know how deep and talented the Japanese team is. This season, though, with Mawasada sitting out, with Akiko Suzuki officially retired, the opportunity is there for someone like Miyahara coming off a bronze medal finish at Skate Canada. This is a skater who definitely has an opportunity to be in the top six at the end of the series and make it to the Grand Prix final. A win would guarantee a trip. She was hoping for her triple, triple there, triple left, triple toe. First triple didn't go off so well. She looks a little tentative. Might be some nerves there, you know. Yes, this is all new to her. She's a little sprite. I love her. She's 4'10". She's so itty-bitty, she makes me feel like a giant. <laughs> Fourth place right now, heading to the free skate. But she can rotate. She doesn't get the height on the jumps, but she gets in there and, and finishes those rotations. And you chuckle, why? Because I don't know how she does it. She really doesn't get that high off. And she doesn't have that much speed going in, which reflects the speed going out. She spent a week in California training with Ilya Kulik. An Olympic champ. That was a much better combination right there. But yes, a, a, a great technician. And she worked a lot on her jumps and her timing. And I toured with Ilya, and on practice, he would work with me a lot. And he was so great when it came to the takeoffs of the jumps. He would pay such detailed attention to that and also the precursor to the takeoff, the mapping and layout of the jumps. And he would always say that the takeoff holds the answer for the landing. But my son, it's your turn to know your father's love. That was a much better combination right there. A little bit more height and distance. I must leave your Satoko was born in Kyoto. Both of her parents are doctors, but she lived in Houston until the age of six. Her parents had moved there for work. She began skating at the age of four attended kindergarten and first grade in the U.S. before moving back to Japan. She speaks English very well. Just so cute. A lot of skaters lose steam at the end of their free skate. She seemed to pick up momentum. 
a lot more comfort by the end. With a win, she would guarantee herself a spot in the final. With a second place finish, she'd be in a tie with Ashley Wagner overall. There'd be a tiebreaker there. Remember? Back with a look in the kiss and cries, Satoko Miyahara waiting for her numbers. And this was her opener combination. She was looking for the triple-triple, would have gained a lot of points there, didn't get height on that takeoff, and obviously didn't get the rotation. Still stood up and went for the double toe, but she needs that speed to really push her through her jumps. This was her second triple Lutz, a little bit better, but again, those landings, the judges are keeping an eye on that to make sure she gets those three rotations. Yeah. Her coach says she's been coaching for some 30 years and has never met a skater who works as diligently as Satoko does. 60-34, 57-99, and overall 179-02 into first place. Lots of potential, and that training will pay off. She needs a little bit more polish and experience, but I'm excited to see what's in store for her the next couple years. Mike Paulina Edmonds, just 16.